I'm so honored to be coming to you today from Treaty 6 territory. It's a place where people have gathered to listen and share for tens of thousands of years. And so today, I'm glad you're here to learn with me. So we're going to do one of my favorite festive fun things that we do every year in my family. We make little candy houses out of graham crackers and some of our favorite treats. So I started out by making the icing and it's really messy for me to make this. I should have used a bigger bowl because I have icing sugar all over my kitchen. But it takes a cup of icing sugar, two teaspoons of water, two teaspoons of corn syrup, and a teaspoon of lemon juice. And you beat that all up until you have kind of a gluey paste. Now, it's like a glue for our little candy houses. And I've started to put some together just so they would dry. But you have to be careful with the graham crackers when you break them apart because you want to keep them into nice squares. These ones, I've used the gluten-free ones, and so they're a little smaller, but they're going to be just as cute. And so I'm taking my graham crackers apart, and then I'm using just a little bit of my royal icing, and I'm putting that along the edge. And just like glue, we don't want to use too much. So I'm just going to show you how to make this square, and then we'll come right back and show you how we like to decorate them because we want to let it dry for a few minutes so that we can, uh, just so that it doesn't fall apart while we're building. And so this is something that I've done with my children and my nieces and nephews and my brothers and sisters. And it's just a really fun thing that we like to do in December. Now, these are great for little decorations around the house, but they're also fun to eat. And sometimes we use leftover candy and sometimes we buy new candy. So now what I've done is I've taken two of my squares and I put a little bit of the glue on them. And then I'm just going to put a couple more little crackers on. And there we go. Now we have the base, four little crackers, and then I'm going to build a little roof by gluing two pieces together. And then we stick those on top, and we'll come back and we'll decorate in just a few minutes. I'm back with Jasmine, and I put some of the icing in some baggies and cut the end off, so it's sort of like a, a frosting bag. Now what we got now is we have some gumdrops, some little snowmen, some gummy bears, and other candies. I got some of this, we call this rainbow bacon in our house, and some M&Ms. And now we're going to put little bits of our icing glue on our house and decorate it up. And so that's what we're going to do for the next couple of minutes. I um, have started to set my, I have my gluten-free one and my regular up. I have cut a gumdrop in half to make a little, couple of little trees. So I'm going to set those up, and this is going to be my little, my little street. So, Jasmine, do you? Um, I know that just before we started, you decided that you didn't only want to decorate this house. Well, what did you do just before? Oh, we got I took a bite out of the roof. Because sometimes you find that when we're working on projects like this, it's too tempting and you want to eat all the candy. So make sure you get a lot of candy for this project. So I thought on this one, I, uh, I wanted to make a rainbow roof because this um, rainbow candy is super fun. Um, I thought I'd put a gummy bear by the front because that's who's going to live in my house here. I'm going to set a snowman up in the my little snowman. neighborhood just to, uh, it's sort of like those big inflatable snowmen that oh, people yeah. have in the yard. So it's not really all that, you know, it's not completely out of character mm -hmm. that you'd have that. So we're just going to keep on decorating our houses and we will show you at the end what they look like. So we finished our little neighborhood 
Well, we've got it part way done. So you can see that I use different types of candy to make my houses. Jasmine's got hers. She also decided she's just going to eat one of them. So it's her it's under construction. So, so I hope you have some fun and make your own little decorations or snacks. Thanks for watching.